Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So it's that time again. Time to take up another champion. This one's going to be a six star. And if you think you can guess who I'm about to take up, leave a comment in the comment section below. But I'm about to reveal it in five, four, three, two, one. Domino! All right, so while I am ranking this girl up, boom, uh, I'll tell you why uh, I'm taking her up uh, right now. Uh, there is a mutant advancement going on, and she has been very useful in the past. Do you guys remember the Summer of Pain? There was a challenge that you actually wanted a domino that was not awakened. She actually did better unawakened against that challenge. Now, I have a five-star domino. My five-star domino is maxed out. She's awakened and all that good stuff. Um, but I also wanted to take up this domino, even though she's not awakened, because she really did help me out. And I like her. I hate fighting against her, but I like her. So up she goes. Now, I've been taking up a lot of uh, mutant champions lately. So let me see. Yeah, we should have enough. Because we got a gift from Kabam. Uh, that was ISO, uh, ISO selector. And so if I were to run out of mutant, I can just grab that one. We may not. Let me see. I think we should have enough, but we'll, we'll find out. If not, we got that selector. But Domino will be useful to me. Uh, not only in the Summer of Pain, which has already passed, but she's a mercenary. She's one of the few mercenaries that I actually have ranked up. And I believe in the Variant 8 that just recently dropped, um, I believe that uh, there's one where mercenaries get a lot of uh, benefit. Uh, I know in the Cavalier, there uh, were some boosts for mercenaries. So she will see some use. And she's pretty cool. I do like her. Yeah, it looks like we should have enough. Won't use that ISO selector for, uh, at least for her. Yeah, see, getting right down to the wire here. Look at that. We had enough. Let's uh, let me grab like three. See if that's enough. Nope. How much do I have? 33, so maybe one more? Yeah, there we go. And that is Domino. And we will uh, take her into Realm of Legends a little bit later and uh, show what she can do. She does a lot of damage and I will have her in there with the uh, Trinity with Red Hulk. Um, Masakre is not really all that necessary. Um, it's mainly that Red Hulk synergy. All right. So in a moment, we'll head on over there and uh, take on Winter Soldier. So be right back. All right. I'm back. And I'm sorry I'm getting this video out to you late. Uh, it is 936 right now, p.m. my time. I just got done with my six stars and I'm about to do my five stars, but I wanted to finish up this video so I can get it out to you guys today. I'm trying to get Craven as a five star. All right. But anyway, this is the team I'm going to go in with. This is her synergy team. Uh, I'll show you a little bit here. The two star red Deadpool. That's the highest I have. Um, I forgot how I got him. I think there was an arena uh, and we got the two star red Deadpool. But all the other ones are behind a paywall. All right, but let's take a look at the synergies active. 
This does 10% more damage uh, against champions that aren't female or robots. Okay. The next one, um, uh, each time Domino performs a well, uh, well-timed block, the chance for her to be lucky increases by uh, plus 10% the next time she fills a power bar, uh, bar of power. Uh, we've got this one here. Her debuffs last longer. Uh, a lot of people who play Domino are familiar with this one. Uh, in the uh, Labyrinth of Legends, it means that she'll have infinite uh, parries. Okay. Uh, then we've got this one. Heavy attacks inflict and incinerate. Uh, that deals damage equal to that heavy attacks damage over two seconds. I'll show you that. Um, but uh, we're going to mix it up a little bit as well. Because uh, she does some crazy damage still. All right. Let's uh, get in there. We've got class advantage. All right. So first, man, I hate hate this uh, Winter Soldier. See, he's, he's pausing. He's not attacking me. See, I couldn't get a, a parry in because he's not attacking. There we go. Now he attacked. All right. So now you see the damage. That's a lot of damage. Just look at this. Look at the damage. Just the heavy attacks. We're going to do another fight. But I wanted to show you guys just how devastating her heavy attacks are with that uh, red Hulk synergy. Look at his health. Look at his health. That is crazy. All right. Keep going. Keep going. Come on. This one... All about them heavy attacks. Just look at that damage. And I do have deep wounds. Um, I don't think it plays a part uh, in this particular one here. Come on. Just look at that. But the debuffs lasting longer does give her some more damage. <laughs> this Winter Soldier is doing everything he can to keep me from uh, getting them parries off. Look at that. He just stopped short. But even my parry um, will last longer. The parry stun. Look at this. Crazy damage. Man, it's a lot of damage. Oh, he got me. I tried to do a reparry and it didn't work. All right, come on. Come on. Is that going to be it? Yep. There we go. Uh, now, I've turned on the uh, beta features for the first time. So we'll actually be able to look at uh, the stats here. So... Uh, the damage to myself, 91% of it came from Liquid Courage, my own suicides, okay? Basic attack, 6%, that was when he caught me. Uh, special attacks, 1%. Um, I'm assuming that's from the uh, block damage that I took. Uh, anytime I, I took any block damage from his uh, specials. But look at that incinerate. Look at how much damage my incinerate did crazy um 60 were incinerate and 40 percent uh basic attacks okay that is insane all right uh we're going to do that fight again and this time i'm not going to do the uh parry heavy we're just going to go in uh and start doing some bleed damage and and we can see how uh she does there okay so you can see all them crits. Just look at those crits. He's unlucky, so... Boom. 19k crit. Okay, let's build up to a special two. Come on. Come on. All 
All right, I'm lucky. He's unlucky. Woo! Look at that damage. Look at that damage. All right, let's uh, build up to a special three. Just look at the damage. Quick, too. The fighting like this is more fun to me than just doing the uh, heavy attacks. Oh, yeah. I was lucky he was unlucky. Let's see if we get a crit bleed. Woo! Do it! Nope. Didn't get one. I don't think. So that's a lot of bleed damage anyway. All right, hit him with a special one. Hit him with a special one. No crit on that special one. He's always got to get me with a couple of hits. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come on. Finish it off. Boom. Was that a, a 28K crit? Couldn't tell. All right. So, uh, Liquid Courage did less damage, I think. Because I think this fight... Let me see... I should have looked at it. Um, I love the fight duration. So you can tell which fight lasted longer, all that good stuff. You have to take into consideration that I was getting hit. I got stunned in the second one. Uh, so it was going to, you know, extend the fight a little bit longer. Um, the bleed did 21% damage, 37% uh, from the specials, 42% from the basic attacks. Pretty good. All right. Um, let's do one more fight. And I'll do a combination. I'll do... Um, curious to see what that thing says there. Okay. Just don't block. It's cool. All right. Come on. Just, just don't want to fight right. Come on. Nope. Just don't want to attack me. Okay. You know what? Back up. What is this with the tie? You know what? Here. Eat a little bit of this. Thank you. Finally let me parry her once. Okay. Woo! That was a crit bleed. That's a lot of damage we're doing with that crit bleed right there, man. Look at that. And because I'm running deep wounds, that bleed lasted even longer. So the Masakre Synergy had the debuff lasting longer. And then deep wounds, which I have maxed, also. Okay. Okay. Didn't see her unlucky, but she got lucky. So, Let's see what happens here. Okay. That bleed is doing some work, though. 11k crit. Bleed is still doing some work. There we go. Finish it. 21k crit. And a 7k crit. Nasty. Alright. Let's take a look at the stats here. Yeah, the fight lasted a little bit longer than the Winter Soldier fight, but, you know, not too long. Uh, let's see. Yeah, 30%, 32% uh, bleed damage. Almost as much as my basic attacks. Uh, more than the special attacks themselves, because I believe damage was legit. All right. So that's going to do it for this video. Thank you all for watching. Domino is still a beast. Uh, I ranked her up because I do like her, and she was helpful in the Summer of Pain. But uh, she's also a mercenary. Um, and I did have, uh, you know, Nebula is also ranked up. 
uh, to rank two as a six star. Um, but I wanted to get her up there as well. So take care. Hit the like button if you enjoyed the video. Leave a comment. Let me know what you thought about the video. And you all have a blessed day. Thank you.